Hey guys, uh, welcome to your love reading. Uh, this is going to be for Gemini for the second half of your May uh, from the 16th to 31st. You can apply this to your Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus signs. Uh, so we're going to take a look at your over energies regarding love and the person that you are connecting with and then we'll take a look at your person to see what their current true feelings and intentions are towards you and then we'll finish off with the uh, outcome um, and possibilities. Uh, what you what you guys need to know um, apply this to your own unique situation this could be anyone that you're connecting with okay so it could be someone new old current switch the roles if you want keep in mind that these are general messages so take what resonates and leave the rest behind if this message uh, didn't resonate take a look at your other placements if you guys haven't done so yet hit the subscription button and the notification bell so that you guys get notified on when my new videos post uh, give this video a thumbs up like this video, share this video, leave a comment down in the comment section below if this message resonates. Uh, for those of you guys that are interested in booking a private personal reading with me, the link for that is in the description box below. Also, um, keep in mind that these are collective messages for the collective um, Gemini people, not tapping into one specific person's energies in particular. If you're looking for a reading that's tailored to your own situations, to your energies, I suggest you book a private personal reading with me, okay? So we're going to pull some tarot and then we'll finish off the read with some uh, oracle messages. Um, over energies for Gemini regarding love and the person that they are connecting with for the second half of their May from the 16th to 31st. Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus signs for Gemini. Knight of Cups, Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces energy. Seems like someone here might be approaching you here with some, like a couple of. Could be dealing with the Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces. King of Cups, Knight of Cups. Seven of Pentacles. And Knight of Wands. I feel like we have someone here that you're dealing with that does not want to waste any more time. Yeah, I feel like this person just, this person wants to be with you. Or that you want to be with this person. Uh, Knight of Wands, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius energy. Queen of Wands, Aries, Leo, Sag, and the Queen of Pentacles here. Could be a situation that someone here is viewing someone here who's very attractive, okay? And someone very stable. Someone who's marriage material. Someone here who's adventurous. Someone here who has, you know, their shit together, okay? Uh, someone here who's spontaneous, uh, let's see what else we have here. Uh, Queen of Wands, Aries, Leo, Sag, Queen of Pentacles, Capricorn, Taurus, Virgo. So either you're this Queen here or this uh, King. Knight of Cups, Six of Wands, King of Cups, Five of Cups. Seems like someone here is coming in with an apology. Maybe someone here is apologizing because their ego got in the way, Okay. But I feel like this person knows where victory and success lies now. Yeah, it seems like someone here does not want to waste any more time. Seven of Pentacles. We have the Hangman here. Piscean Energy. Knight of Wands. And we have the Two of Cups. Yeah, I feel like someone here no longer wants to wait. No longer, no longer wants to waste any more time and wants to pursue a relationship here with you, uh, Gemini. Okay? Uh, Piscean Energy with the Hangman. Queen of Wands. We have the Ace of Swords. Queen of Pentacles. And then the Sun. I mean, this person could be seeing as someone here who's very positive, happy, outgoing, you know, optimistic, okay, very honest and very truthful. Um, could be a situation that, you know, if this king made this queen wait, this queen didn't wait, okay? So um, let's see what else we have here. Tell me about uh, Gemini's person. What is this person's current true feelings and intentions towards Gemini for the second half of their May from the 16th to the 31st? Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus signs for Gemini. Pentacles, King, Queen of Swords. Okay. Kings of Queen of Pentacles. That's a true pair, soulmate connection. Ten of Wands. 
Three of Cups. Seems like someone here might be dropping all their connections because they want to be with you. But look at that. We have this king looking at this queen, but this queen is not paying any attention to this uh, this uh, king here. So I feel like this queen is you, um, uh, Gemini. Okay, this person is dropping other parties, dropping, dating other people or meeting other people here. Seems like this person was unsure whether they wanted to be with you, but now it seems like they're sure. We have the Five of Pentacles and the Four of Wands. We have someone here who's missing you, okay? This person fears that they can miss out on a relationship with you for uh, messing around with other people, for being unsure. Could be dealing with a soulmate twin flame here, all right? Uh, you definitely have a strong soul tie with this individual, especially, you know, with the pairs here, with the King of Pentacles and the Queen of Pentacles. Tell me about this King of Pentacles. We have the Eight of Pentacles, Queen of Swords. We have the Ace of Cups. Yeah, this person's in love with you. Uh, this person's actually working on making this big change here or that they're, they, they're wanting to fix this, okay? Uh, Ten of Wands, while the Empress here, the um, Three of Pentacles and the Three of Cups and the Eight of Swords. I feel like while this person was with other people, this person could not stop thinking about you. I feel like this person could not let an Empress go. Eight of Swords. Five of Pentacles, High Priestess, Four of Wands, and the Six of Pentacles. Seems like this person fears it might be over. You know, I feel like this person feels like they should have done the right thing prior, you know? But I feel like this person does want to give to this, this relationship. This person does want to give to you and this connection here. This person could have been breadcrumbing you. Yeah, because I do feel like this person was dealing with other people. Um, outcome and advice here for Gemini regarding their love situation for the um, uh, end, uh, not the end, for the second half of their May from the 16th to the 31st. Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus signs. What else does um, Gemini need to know? What else does Gemini need to know? Nine of Pentacles, Virgo energy, pre Empress energy. Okay, so we have the King to Queen of Swords, King to Queen of Pentacles, true pairs here. You have true pairs here. I mean, this person's definitely in love with you, I feel. All right, the Empress and oh, oh the Moon and the Six of Swords. Okay, you know, I, I feel like we have a masculine here that's trying to conquer their fears here. This, uh, this masculine is also going to come in with the truth, also. So that you guys could move over to calmer waters. Uh, you know, if there was a lax in communication, I feel like the communication will get better here. Uh, Page of Pen uh, Cups and the Five of Wands here. I do feel like you guys might end up arguing. I feel like you're very mad at this individual here, um, uh, Gemini. Uh, Page of Cups, Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces. Yeah. So someone here is hoping for a new beginning. Let's see what else we have here. Tell me about the Nine of Pentacles. Why is this Nine of Pentacles here? Nine of Pentacles. We have the Seven of Swords. We have the King of Swords and the Lovers. Soulmate connection. But I feel like, you know, you're protecting yourself with the Seven of Swords or that you're trying to get away from this individual here, um, uh, Gemini. Could be dealing with another Gemini. The Moon. We have the Knight of Swords. The Six of Swords and the King of Wands. Yeah, we have someone here that's rushing in with some communication, trying to tell you the truth here or uh, reveal uh, some secrets that this person was hiding from you. Uh, Page of Cups, we have the Two of Wands, Five of Wands, and the Four of Pentacles here. You know, I feel like this individual is really stuck. And yeah, I feel like this person is hoping that you guys won't fight, but I feel like a fight is going to break out. I do feel like eventually someone here is going to block someone. Yeah, sounds like this was a really bad situation here. We have the tower and the devil in the strength card. Seems like someone here couldn't control themselves. Okay, so uh, let's pull some um, oracle messages and then we'll end it there. What else do we have here for Gemini regarding their love situation for the second half of their May from the 16th to the 31st? Sun, moon, rising, Venus signs for Gemini separation. I don't think this is going to come back together. Yeah, I, 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 we have trust because I feel like you don't trust this person. 
Yeah, I feel like there could be new love that's coming towards you, and this could be the one. Let's see what else we have here. What else do we have for Gemini regarding love and the person that they are connecting with? Friends with benefits. You see, I feel like this person was definitely messing around. Could be a situation that this person was like telling you that you were in a relationship, but this person was pretending, or you know, this person could have been out and about just saying that you guys are not together. Seems like you guys have a past like relationship together. What else do we have here for Gemini regarding love? Please be patient with me. I feel like you're at your wit's end with this person. Seems like this was a one-sided relationship. Yeah, seems like expect communication because I feel like someone here is going to reach out. You're always on my mind, okay? Yeah, it seems like there's going to be a fight that's going to break out, like I said. Look at that. Fights, arguments, and conflict. What else do we have for Gemini regarding love and the person that they are connecting with? Soulmate. Seems like this is a soulmate here. Yeah, the thing is, um, you're coming up as the Empress. It just seems like you're pursuing new love. You know, it seems like you're pursuing new love. And I feel like someone here has learned the lessons. And this could be you, um, uh, Gemini. I do feel like you're this Empress, pre-Empress, slash Queen. Um, what else do we have here for Gemini regarding love and the person that they are connecting with? I am battling inner demons. Yeah, could be could be reason why that this person was doing this. You know, there is a saying, hurt people, hurt other people. Childhood wounding is influencing my actions. And that's the obstacle here with this individual. So I feel like you didn't want to weather the storm with this individual. But that's why this person is asking you to be patient with them. Yeah, there is someone keeping me from you. So this person could be dealing with other people, like I said. All right? Maybe even multiple people. So, um, Gemini, I hope this was helpful. Hope this resonated. If it did, leave a comment down in the comment section below. Share this video. Like this video if you haven't done so yet. Subscribe. Hit the notification bell. I will speak to you guys in the next one. Thanks.